Hello, I'm Dr. Lawrence D. Wagman, the Executive Medical Director for the Center for Cancer Prevention and Treatment at St. Joseph Hospital. I'd like to welcome you to our website and to our new cancer center. What you'll find when you get here is a center that's designed to bring the best in modern cancer care to our community. We'll bring you fine care, fine physicians, access to research trials, and particularly a view of the cancer world focused on prevention. Prevention has become one of the most important components of cancer care, stopping the disease before it even starts. And we've made a commitment here to focus on the research and the actual delivery of prevention. We started programs in breast cancer, in colon and rectal cancer, lung cancer, and prostate cancer, which focuses the idea, the concept, and the delivery of specific treatments to prevent cancer. We're reaching out to our community, to the individuals in our community, and to the doctors who provide care for patients day after day. Not just the specialists, but the family doctors, the internists, the pediatricians, the doctors who see you each and every day. We're trying to get the message to them, and we know we'll be successful about the importance of prevention and just where it stands in the world of cancer. We have a beautiful new structure here on La Vida. It includes three floors of cancer care delivery, administration, the collection of important information about our patients, and we're right next to a large medical office building that houses many of the doctors who provide care here in the center. We've created this physical structure which brings together the skills in taking care of cancer patients and the ability to learn more about them through clinical trials, through collection of information, and through careful coordination. We're focused on the full spectrum of the care of the cancer patient, not just the delivery of a surgery or the delivery of a drug or the delivery of a radiation, all of which we do extraordinarily well, have in the past and will continue to do in the future with new innovative as well as standard treatments. But we're also interested in the whole part of the care of the cancer patient. What happens to their families? What happens to their health in general? What occurs to them psychologically as they go through these very challenging treatments? And we look for, to the future. The minute a cancer patient is diagnosed as having cancer, we start thinking about how we'll care for them for the rest of their lives.